hey everybody and welcome back to our channel in today's video we are going to show you how to order animations here in canva let's begin now the first thing that you need to do was to log in using your credentials if this is your first time in canva i want you to click the sign up option and from here just follow the on-screen instructions and you're good to go Ordering animations in Canva allows you to control the sequence in which elements appear or animate in your design. I find it very useful for presentations or videos. Now, once you are logged into your account, I want you to click on the project or design that you're working with. If you haven't already, just go to the template section here and choose from business, social media, education, video, marketing, or print products, or even you can choose the card and invitations. I'm actually working with a specific presentation. Now, I'm going to start with an image here on top. And for you to be able to order the animations in Canva, you might want to click first the element that you wanted to have an animation. For example, the text here. I want you to click on it and there's an option that says animate. All right. Now from here, you can choose from any of these. Like if you want to put it a rise option, a pan, a fade all right a pop a wipe is it gonna be blur now let me choose the blur if you click on blur there's gonna be another option wherein you can increase the speed or decrease the speed but that only works if you are using the canva pro you see all of the icons with the crown watermark means you can only use this feature if you are subscribed to the canva pro however i am using the free trial so i can't um basically um use it you see, you can try Pro for 30 days. If you have this notification, that means you are on free trial. Now, in the animate right here, you can choose, is it going to be entering on both or just enter or on exit? Right, so you have all of these. Now, I'm going to use both for the animate, right? Another option is, of course, the main uh, photo or the main image. You can... Of course choose any of the uh, animations here for example is it going to be rise if i wanted to check just click on the uh, effects here to see which one would you like to use just slowly i find i like the succession but let's uh later i'm gonna choose later on maybe succession for now and on the bottom i'm gonna choose on enter or on exit i'm gonna choose both or enter on, on enter only all right now the next uh, thing is i'm going to choose uh, the video at the back the left side so i have like um, an option at the bottom it says wiggle flicker flicker looks nice pulse how about rotate no it's not photo zoomed photo rise photo flow stomp scrapbook Neon, maybe like breathe for now. All right, let's use the breathe. I'm gonna use the effect again on the uh, right side. The another video. Maybe I'm going to choose uh, the breathe. I like it. I like it. All right, but I'm not gonna choose the uh, on both. I'm just gonna use for the enter. You see, after that, I want you to click on the positions because on the positions you have all of these rest and you can arrange them so you can have the order of the animations all right so the first is going to be you can put it here put it back all right so this is one of the easiest way to order animations in camera remember that the animation affects the elements right and the elements are one layer so if you move the elements in order you would be able to have an effect of ordering the animations here in canva once you are happy with it all right so Let's try to click on the play button on the upper right corner to see if the elements blend well together, right? As you can see, properly ordered animations can help convey a narrative message effectively. By controlling the sequence, you can guide the audience through your content in a logical and engaging manner. You can emphasize the key points in elements or design, drawing the audience's attention to important information at the right moment. Once you are happy with it, you might want to click on the share button on the upper right corner and download it as an MP4. But if you want to share this to your client, just click on the copy link.
Thank you so much for watching and we will see you again in the next video.